As part of the I-10 widening project, the Bluff Road overpass is closed for the summer. And as Local 33's Amber Smith explains to us now, this closure combined with another in the area has some area residents feeling trapped and unsafe. Rolling along Bluff Road, drivers are met with this sign. It really makes it a, a bad inconvenience for everyone. The Bluff Road overpass is closed until August while crews work to replace a main girder and raise the bridge approximately nine inches. Ken and Linda Munson live in the Fountain Hill neighborhood right by the overpass. And they say the closure is already an inconvenience. The only way to get in and out of our neighborhood is we have to go about five or six miles out of our way to get, for instance, today we need to go to Home Depot. And what would normally take me, ten, take me 10 minutes, it's going to now take me a half an hour. Right now, the Bluff Road overpass is closed due to construction, and so is Alligator Bayou. That's been closed since the 2016 flood. Both of these two projects combined means there's only one way in and one way out. Alligator Bayou and Manshack Roads offer an alternative to Bluff Road, but it's been closed for nearly two years now while crews work to widen the floodgate under the road. Prince is just an inconvenience, plus Alligator Bayou Road is shut down, so to, we can't go there, we can't go here. There's only one way in and out. Kind of a dangerous situation also. And with the raining yesterday, we were wondering, because it flooded down there. <laughs> if it flooded, we would be stuck. No way in or out. Residents say they just hope it opens up soon to give them more than one option. For Local 33, I'm Amber Smith. Officials with the Ascension Parish say that their section of uh, the Alligator Bayou project is ready, but Iberville Parish is telling them that part in their parish won't be completed until July 5th, which is a Thursday after the holiday.